What? Northern Lights in America? That's right. The Aurora Borealis is back. And this time, it's visible way further south than usual. We're talking 21 U.S. states possibly witnessing those glowing green and purple lights dancing across the sky. No telescope, no trip to Alaska required. According to NOAA's Space Weather Prediction Center, Earth just got hit with a G4-level geomagnetic storm. That's a severe one. Translation? The sun basically threw a magnetic punch strong enough to light up half the northern hemisphere. These storms are triggered by solar flares, massive bursts of energy from the sun's surface. And this one is the strongest we've had in months. It's bending Earth's magnetic field, sending charged particles straight into our atmosphere, and boom, auroras. Where to look? If you're in Montana, North Dakota, Minnesota, Wisconsin, Michigan, Maine, or even parts of New York, Pennsylvania, Vermont, Iowa, Illinois, Nebraska, and Washington, tonight's your chance. Some reports even say the lights could stretch as far south as Colorado and Oregon. Yeah, it's that rare. When to look? Best window, 10 p.m. to 2 a.m. local time. Find a dark open area away from city lights. Face north and let your eyes adjust. If you're lucky, you'll see green ribbons ripple across the sky. And if you're extra lucky, you'll catch red or purple streaks too, caused by higher energy particles. Even if your eyes don't pick up the glow, your phone camera might. Set it to night mode, and you'll be stunned at what it captures. But here's the wild part. This same storm that's giving us beautiful skies could also disrupt satellites, GPS signals, and power grids. So while you're staring at the beauty above, Engineers around the world are literally watching the data, praying nothing fries. Still, for sky watchers, this is history. A cosmic dance across half the United States, a show that lasts only hours, but stays in memory forever. So grab a coffee, step outside, and just look up, because tonight the sky's not dark. It's alive. <laughs>